guys, this is Clara Hudson of While They Play Designs, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to create a garter bobble. And if you take a look here, you can see that this is a bobble that stays on the front side of the work. It does not pop to the back, like a lot of bobbles can do. And it has some great stitch definition with that garter, with those garter bumps on the front. So I'll show you how to create this. We're going to go ahead and work over to the point where we're going to place our bobble. Okay. Now you're going to work into this stitch and we're going to create five new stitches inside of this one stitch. So we're going to knit and do not remove the original stitch from your left hand needle. Now we're going to yarn over our right hand needle, knit again, do not remove the stitch, yarn over, and knit one last time. Now we can remove that original knit stitch from our left hand needle. And if you look, we've created five new stitches from that original knit stitch. We have one, two, three, four, five. Now we're going to turn our work with our yarn in the back, and we're going to knit those five stitches. Two, three, four, five. Now we'll turn again to the right side of our work and knit those five stitches one more time. Three, four, five. So you can see here, we've created the, the garter bumps with those five stitches and now we're simply going to take this, the right or the second stitch on our right hand needle and pass it over the first, like so. And we're gonna do that four times, two, three and four. So we've passed four of those five stitches over the first one and we're left with one loop. And that will just stay on your right hand needle. So you are done with that garter bobble and you can see it's already popping out to the front of our work nicely. So I'm gonna show that to you one more time. I'm gonna speed it up this time. So we're gonna knit, yarn over, knit, yarn over, knit, all in the same stitch. Remove that original stitch, turn our work, knit five, turn our work one last time, and knit five again. Okay, so we've created that garter those garter bumps. Now we're going to take the second stitch, pass it over the first four times. Two, three, and four. So that's how you create the garter bobble. I hope this stitch and this video helps you guys out. Thanks so much for watching. <music>